Hey guys, Reflex here, and today I am bringing you guys a Call of Duty Modern Warfare remastered kind of topic I do want to touch on. Now, I did want to touch on this a couple weeks ago, but I have been busy. I've been grinding out UMGs, and I do want to go ahead and apologize for that, but this has to be talked on on my channel before the game comes out. And that is Supply Drops returning into Call of Duty 4 Remastered. Now this is not confirmed just yet, but a Call of Duty VIP insider that is famous for every leak that ever has been in Call of Duty since around Modern Warfare 3 has actually been hinting at this topic. And that is Charlie Intel. A lot of you guys may know him. I know you guys probably know him most likely from Twitter, but there is a lot of, you know, topics on his website that doesn't make it to Twitter that is actually pretty important. So the link to this article will be in the description below. And yeah, be sure to check that out. But yeah, so let's get right into this. And that is Supply Drops in Call of Duty 4 Remastered. So with that being said, do not jump to the conclusions like I already have stated in this video. But Supply Drops, whether you love them or hate them, or do not know what to think about them, or don't really care about them, let me just go ahead and say that they might, maybe, possibly, highly possibly be coming into Call of Duty 4 Remastered. So recently, Call of Duty 4 Remastered, a lot of news has actually dropped that there's going to be gold camo on about every single gun that there actually is in the game. Now, in the previous Call of Duty 4 original, there was not gold camo on every single gun. So with that being said, the question really is, is there going to be like gold camos, like, you know, a gold P90 or a gold MP5 going to be in a supply drop for you to get it? And also, maybe they might include different gun variants into Call of Duty 4 or maybe even different like calling cards or, you know, different camos or something like that, you know, something crazy to actually, you know, make the game a little bit more unique. Everybody on Twitter and mostly everybody in the community is actually kind of freaking out about this. Everybody is saying, oh, it's going to make the game bad and all this. Honestly, in my honest opinion, I do not think that this is actually going to affect the flow of the game whatsoever. I honestly do not. I think the game is still going to be good and I think the game is still going to be one of the best Call of Duties ever. Be sure to leave a like on the video if you guys did enjoy. Be sure to follow my Twitter. It is in the description as well. Be sure to subscribe to the channel, guys, and thanks a lot. Have an awesome day.